Today I'm going to show you uh, how to connect a JetMed autoscope into Skype so a doctor can send information and share information on Skype with more people. Um, first, um, you need the autoscope, in this case we have the this JetMed autoscope, it's the TD981160 and um, I already put the cup to cover the, the autoscope, this is disposable and the autoscope goes has uh, two cords, the communication cord and the fiber optics cord over here. Okay. Uh, the connect ray in the light source. This is the light source. Now the light source um, has an out output. It's an S video output right here. This is black cable. And the black cable, and uh, we gotta connect this black cable into uh, this black switch box, video box, into the input of the black box. And from here, we connect the output of the video black box into the USB live to device um, once we do that we gotta be sure we connect these two input one and two simultaneously so we can transfer whatever is coming from here and put it out over here okay the next step is uh, you gotta install the usb live 2 in the global net um, download and let me see this this information here i put it in this uh, folder the global net Download this driver, USB Live Windows 7. And then, once everything is installed, you can put, um, you know, upload uh, Skype or Zoom. You can share your your, your desktop. In this case, <clears throat> I'm gonna show you. Um, I'm gonna put this device on my my air okay see this is my air okay it's coming right in The doctor can see everything in there. Okay. The next step I'm going to use it in my nose. Okay. Okay. And the doctor can see that whatever is inside the nose. For inspection and diagnosis. Okay, how cool is it? When you finish, take this off, put this in the garbage.
Is that it? Thank you for watching.